Uh, good, uh, good win by our guys. Um, you know, Portland's a young, scrappy team. They play very, very hard. Hi, Warren. How are you? Okay. <laughs> uh, it, 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 they're scrappy. It, it doesn't matter if they're up big, down big, close game. They're going to get up in you and keep trying to disrupt you. And then they got those two big guys on the backside that clean a lot of stuff up at the rim. Um, but I thought our guys were really good defensively. Um, you know, they shot 42% from the floor, 18% from the two. And so our guys did a great job of trying to follow our game plan on the defense end of the floor. Um, I thought, you know, Keegan stuck his nose in there and rebounded. Doma stuck his nose in there and rebounded. Fox with six rebounds. Uh, even Malik. Malik gave us a big spurt off the bench in the second half. He ended up with four rebounds, but he he was really big in the run that we had in the second half to create uh, separation. He obviously hit a couple of big threes, but he had a couple of Big, big defense possessions. He took a took a charge on a moving uh, moving screen one time, and you know when stuff like that happens, uh, it gives not only our team energy but the crowd. And when the crowd gets energized, obviously it just adds to what we're trying to do out on the floor. So Malik's spurt in the second half was really, really instrumental in us uh, creating the separation that we needed to get over the hump. And then obviously, you know, Foxy. I mean. Man, what a career! Uh, you know what he's done for the city of Sacramento, for the organization. Um, at such a young age, to score his 10,000th point tonight, uh, that should definitely be celebrated. So, congratulations to him, Rase, and the rest of the Fox family, uh, because that's a, a neat milestone to hit at this point in his career. Hey, Mike, you guys had to kind of battle through that that muddy first half, but to defensively be able to to maintain a lead through that and allow your offense the time that it needed to kind of wake up in the second half, how encouraging is that to you to, to see the team's ability to win a game on that side of the floor in addition to the offense? It, it, I mean, it's huge. You, you know, the ball is not going to always go in. Um, you're going to have to be able to play different ways. And that showed tonight. So for our guys to figure out how we can keep trying to get stops, um, while for a stretch there we did a pretty good job of keeping them off the free throw line, that kind of went away. Uh, but but trying to get stops without fouling uh, was huge. And uh, it gave us enough time to find our rhythm offensively and, like you said, open the game up some. You good? You can ask me any question you want. Thank you, Coach. Uh, you were able to su suppress those uh, starter minutes. I think it was a be all started uh, between 32, 35, 36 minutes. Were you, uh, you know, pretty pleased, you know, being able to rest those guys at the right time? Yes, I'm going to give myself a pat on the back <laughs> because I've been killing our guys, <laughs> you know. I mean, for them to get 40 minutes the first game, 37, 38, 39 minutes the second game, and and and, and finally um, the lead helped, but uh, finally to get these guys uh, at a decent number of minutes t in tonight's game uh, is, is very pleasing. Hopefully we can continue trying to find ways to keep those guys in, in the range that we talked about before before the game tonight. Thanks, everyone. Thanks, oh.